Hey guys, this is Rock King 3, bringing in the live commentary, Forza 5. And I'm in the C-Class Hopper, I'm trying a last to first race. And it looks like it's on the Alps reverse. So I did grab a pretty, pretty powerful car of mine, this red Toyota GT86. I like it a lot. It works really well on the Alps in the other direction. I don't know that it does a stellar job going this direction, but... We'll try. Somebody flipped their car. And they seem to be going really fast. <laughs> I've never seen anybody go <laughs> that long on its side. That's funny. Oh, there's a car I about pulled out of this Civic Si. I about used it. <clears throat> Jeez. He absolutely wanted to keep that line. <laughs> I even gave him room. Oh boy. Those guys are being mean to each other here. I'm just trying to stay out of the way. There we go. <laughs> Put myself against the wall trying to stay away from people. So my last to first with everybody pretty much taking themselves out, looks like I have one guy left. I don't know if there'll be any more coming up on me or not, but we shall see. <coughs> When people hit you like that, I try to brush it off just just because I don't think they can see me or something like they're they're in a view that doesn't allow them to see next to them. So when they crush you like that, I, I mean it's not a huge deal. It gets kind of frustrating. Everybody's quitting. Why is everybody quitting? We're down to five people. I think we started with seven. I thought we had nine in the lobby when we started, but we must not have voted for a track that everybody wanted. So I really thought this was going to be a really hard last to first. Not that it isn't difficult still. I still have to pass somebody, but... Everybody kind of like wiped themselves out. Never seen quite a mess like that. Well, now that we're in an open second, I can take some of the lines that I like to take on these turns. I'm sure I got crushed last time. I think that's the Lancia 037, I think. I'm not sure. Didn't quite try to make that turn very well. I think we're catching him. I mean, he's doing a pretty good job keeping a distance, but I think we're catching him. Oh, yeah, we're definitely catching him now. He's going to hit the rail. Oh, no, he didn't. Nice turn. <clears throat> Thought for sure he was going to hit the rail there. Slide up here a little bit. See if we make this. There we go. Nice clean turn. Okay, we just have to drive relatively decent here for the last lap. And we should have it. So what I did is my first race tonight, I did a D-Class hopper, and we did a last to first, and then I went to this C-Class here, and did last to first. Now, since we're successful, well, I shouldn't count that already. If we're successful, we'll move up to the B-Class. Um, it is a lot more difficult to move up in the classes and stay, be able to do the last to first. It's just a lot more difficult. <clears throat> the 
This car's a little bit loose for this track. I don't remember being quite this loose, but that's all right. Oh, jeez, that's not even close. I have always loved this paint job on this car, though. It's so cool. I think it was a TJ Barnburner's paint job, I think. I think he's a turn 10 employee. But the BRZ and the Toyota GT86 always do pretty well on these Alps tracks. All right, looks like we're gonna pull it off. So hopefully <clears throat> the next last to first you see is from B-Class. Been pretty fortunate in the D and the C tonight. One that the lobbies have been kind of half full, so I don't have to start 16th. All right, we did it in C class as well, successful. Thanks a lot for watching, guys, and we'll hopefully catch you in the next B class hopper. Later.